everybody. Today I am sharing um, this junk journal. It is for the swap on junk journal junkies for uh, the Roaring Twenties. And all of us in my family, we really love movies and movie trivia and all kinds of things. So, of course, I had to go with um, something of, of that nature. So I'm calling this one uh, the Silver Screen. And uh, just found some really cool images. I found a place that had uh, uh, portraits of some of the stars from the 20s. Really nice ones that I could download and print. So I did that. And this is a uh, cover of a, a magazine from 1924. And I kind of went with some silver and uh, the black just because I thought that was, I don't know, Hollywoodish. So we'll go ahead and go on in if I can get it undone. And it got a little chunky. And oops, let me get that. Um, for the f front here, what I did was I printed out um, the first. Oscars, uh, Academy Awards were in the 1920s, 1929. So I just printed out a little bit about what that was, and I thought it was funny because now they're, gosh, three hours long, and nobody can stay up that late. And uh, they were 15 minutes, the very first uh, Academy Awards. So I thought that was kind of cute. So we've got some stars. And... Uh, all kinds of little tuck spots and a lot of writing paper. The paper that I used, I used every bit of it. Chopped it up and made it into note cards. Um, I had a whole bunch of other stuff left over so I just collaged it on. I don't know if that's necessarily 20s. Maybe whoever gets this can put it in another book. Um, but here, for example, is a really nice picture. This is Mary Pickford. Quite pretty. And here's another, I believe that's Janet Gaynor with her uh, Oscar. And just some 20s images. There's a note card. I'll just run through it quickly. I thought that was really cute. I had to have that stamp. And it used to be, the Hollywood sign used to say Hollywood Land. So I was really excited to find this uh, picture. And it's escaping me who some of these people are. And here's a bow, or, or excuse me, a Clara bow in this glassine envelope. And this is, oh my goodness, the I want to be, um, oh, I can't think of her name. Uh, it'll come to me later when I'm done. Uh, Charlie Chaplin, here's some just little tags. Another little tag, and there's another little spot here as well. And a fold out. Isn't she pretty? And that is Rudolph Valentino. Quite handsome. And there's lots of little writing paper and uh, again some more of these collage just to show where all of the spots are. Of course whoever gets this can do whatever they like with it. There's another pretty young actress. And here's another movie magazine cover from 1922, a whole 10 cents. And her clothing is just amazing. Look at those shoulders. Ah, love it. And lots of writing spots, this paper. A lot of it reminded me of, you know, something that you might see in 
uh, a theater, you know, or the wallpaper of that era. There's a double uh, belly band here. And she looks like a, a little gypsy right there, doesn't she? There's a little double spot here. Of course, I have to put one of Daisy's roses in here. And some more paper. And I used, you know, silvers, grays, some golds. There's a little fold out. And of course stars. There's a, a bigger collage tag that I made with just scraps. And Buster Keaton is who this is. We'll fold down. And this is, she is just a model, and this would have been a, um, an evening gown that someone may have worn. That's, that's what their evening gowns sort of look like. Uh, one signature, there's 15 sheets, so 60 pages. And I also, on that same site, I found an end screen that they used to put up on the on the movies and that's what I used for the end and oh my goodness I am so sorry I cannot remember her name but um, another movie star from the 20s and uh, what a pretty pretty picture that is and there we go so this is my submission for the Roaring Twenties swap and I hope you like it, and I hope whoever gets it likes it. And thanks for stopping by. You have a great day. Bye.